Sup guys, this is Brian Story, and welcome to your first tutorial on Linux, but specifically Ubuntu. Ubuntu is an operating system, and an operating system lets your programs talk to the hardware. So what I mean is, your movie player goes to your operating system, and it says it has to speak to you. The operating system redirects that message to the audio card, and the audio card decides it's not a good idea, but what the heck. And now you guys can hear me, so congratulations, your operating system is apparently working. Linux offers a rock solid foundation for servers and programming. Although it won't offer out of the box gaming solutions, it will offer plenty of solutions for word processing, playing movies, and audio as expected. Okay guys, let's get started. Go to ubuntu.com right here. Click on get ubuntu now. You'll be brought to the download page. Uh, download the desktop version. This comes with all the GUI stuff we'll cover. Download a 32-bit version. Let that start downloading. And as that starts downloading, we're going to go back and we're going to go over the installation instructions. Guys, you're going to need a thumb drive, at least a 2 gigabyte thumb drive. If you have a bigger one, that's fine. You can just use it and then reformat it later. But if you don't have a thumb drive, you can go ahead and use a CD, and there's some instructions on how to do that here. Uh, we're using Windows, so we're going to actually make a bootable USB stick, and I'm going to run you through it real fast. So when I click on that link right there, I'm brought to this page where, again, it reminds you to have a 2 gigabyte thumb drive. Blah, sorry, I couldn't speak. I just could not get that word out there. Thumb drive. Download the pen drive this uh, little Linux installer program here. We'll just download that really quickly. Now uh, let's open that up and it asks you to agree to their terms of service. Go ahead and agree. It won't install anything on your computer. So go ahead and pop this list down. You're gonna see that you can install a whole buttload of stuff on this thumb drive. Like all kinds of different types of Linux and flavors and like here's Linux Mint and there's Kubuntu and oh man all the, all this good stuff but anyway what we're gonna do is we're going to install 12.04 because that's the latest version and it asks you to select where the ISO is if you didn't download the ISO you can go ahead and just click this right here and it'll it'll step you through it but we already downloaded it so we're alright we're gonna just go to browse and I downloaded mine to the desktop there it is pop that open we're gonna select our thumb drive so I, I put one in that's four gigabytes it is H and I know it's H because I looked make sure you look guys don't format just any number in here and assume that it's gonna be alright um, we're just gonna click create it's gonna give you a reminder of a few things of what it's gonna do exactly everything's gonna be overwritten blah 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 basically your thumb drive is gonna be a Linux bootable drive but you guys can reformat this later and I'll show you how if you want click yes you're gonna get this kind of prompt window so just take a second and a matter of fact this is gonna take a couple minutes so I'm gonna speed through this really fast and uh, yeah see you guys in a sec okay so once that's done installation done process is complete Click close, and if you go to my computer, you go to pen drive, H, you'll see all of these files here, including Wubi. I don't know what Wubi stands for, but Wubi. So guys, subscribe, leave me some comments, and uh, check out the next video, part two.